Extrados Bridge, or Extrados, depending on who's saying the word, is a hybrid of two different structures. One structure being a concrete box girder structure like the 35W Bridge. Another structure being a cable stay structure such as the Sunshine Skyway Bridge in Tampa, Florida. Uh, as part of the environmental process, the collaborative group, which is a diverse group of stakeholders ranging from cities and counties and, and uh, uh, other public entities to environmental groups. And as part of the environmental process, they chose, the collaborative, chose to, uh, to select this structure type because of its unique design to minimize the environmental impacts. And the uniqueness of the design that helps minimize that is the combination of a box girder structure and a cable stay. Uh, and that combination or that hybrid design allows us to reduce the tower heights, uh, which is one of the requirements of the collaborative, to keep the towers of the piers below the top of the bluff line. Um, we're able to minimize those tower heights to approximately 60 feet above the deck of the structure where a normal cable stay structure could be upwards of 300 feet above the deck of the structure. It's a very aesthetic pleasing structure which is one of the reasons why the collaborative selected this structure type for this project. It will help uh, minimize the number of piers in the water which will ultimately eliminate environmental impacts on the project, which is another reason why the collaborative selected this structure. And so we're very happy to be and, and excited to be building this type of, of structure, the Extrados Bridge across the St. Croix River, and uh, we're going to work very hard to minimize the environmental impacts associated with this project during construction and uh, long term. Mm -hmm. It's a proven design that's been used in Europe and Japan in addition to Canada and there's a, there's a structure, Extrados Bridge being built in Connecticut currently. Other factors such as cost, aesthetics, constructability because of the complexities of the area and the uh, environmental sensitivity all played a, a significant factor in choosing this type of structure. The cable stay concrete box girder hybrid allows for longer spans which eliminates piers in the water improving the navigational aspects of the river and with fewer piers we also minimize our footprint and the environmental impact to the area. There's a variety of safety elements incorporated into the structure uh, and the design there will be aesthetic lighting uh, for just visual elements of people in the area that will aid in the safety of the, of the structure and the performance of the structure in the river. There will be navigational lighting that will assist uh, boaters in the area. There will be uh, walkway lighting along the walks that, that uh, assist the pedestrians. And there will be roadway lighting to assist the drivers. It will be uh, structurally redundant in the design for the structural capability of this bridge and the functionality of the bridge. I think there are a few things that I've talked about already. Um, one being the environmental sensitivity of the, of the structure and the design. Uh, there was many years put into the development of this project uh, by the collaborative and many other individuals uh, and through that work and all that hard work, I believe they've come up with a, a, a very sensitive design to the environment, uh, a very complementary design to the context that it's going to be within, and I think it complements the context that it's in and does not overwhelm it. It definitely will not be the focal point when you look at the animation. The focal point is still the valley and that has always been the focus of the collaborative and I think they were successful in what they've chosen for a design. Uh, I think in the end this structure will be a structure that the whole river valley and the region can be very immensely proud of and I think people around the world potentially will be attracted to come and see the work that's been done and the planning that ultimately brought us to the successful completion of this project. Mm -hmm.